He was a tough Aussie fast bowler, but years of sending sizzlers down the pitch have taken their toll. Jeff Lawson's sporting career left him with chronic pain from arthritis until he was given a revolutionary treatment. I couldn't bend my knee all the way. I bowled him. Consistent pain. You can never get away, away from it. And he's gone. You lose your ability to become active. He's one of Australia's cricketing greats. In the air court, the slow ball has got him. For years, Jeff Lawson, or Henry as he's known to many, put his body through its paces. Being a fast bowler, uh, that's probably the most stressful thing we can do, in, certainly in cricket. And being right-handed, all the stress goes through your left-hand side, ankles, knees, hips, back, the whole, the whole works. And when you bowl, you know, ten times your body weight goes through your left-hand side. Jeffrey Lawson has got through. But all those years of thundering into the crease close, finally no, took close. a hefty yes, toll. We talk about tens of thousands of, of deliveries. You finally wear out. So swap it over. Now a cricket commentator and coach, Jeff was in the early stages of osteoarthritis. There was fluid on my knee and you could tell the swelling was there. I couldn't bend my knee all the way. Refusing to let it slow him down, the 55-year-old was forced to use medication to dull the pain. At my age, I don't want to spend another, you know, 20, 25, 30 years, whatever, taking tablets. It's very good. Is it? <laughs> Fearing he would eventually have to undergo surgery, Jeff went in search of an alternative. I was getting to the stage in the very short term where I wasn't going to put up with it. That's when Dr Ralph Bright offered him, at no cost, stem cell therapy. Yeah. When he came to see me, he certainly couldn't play cricket. He was struggling to coach because he couldn't demonstrate things that he wanted to do. The treatment aims to reduce joint inflammation and in some cases even regrow cartilage. It begins with a mini liposuction where up to half a litre of fat is extracted, usually from the patient's hips. It's then taken to the lab where technicians extract the stem cells before they're injected back into the patient's joint. When we inject them into a vein, they will go around the body looking for somewhere to attach and they'll be attracted to areas of inflammation. We don't rely upon other drugs or pharmaceuticals that can have adverse events. And I think from that point of view, it's, it's, it's the way of the future. Earlier this year, we met 65-year-old Florence Benson, who was undergoing the procedure. We would collect around 2 million stromal cells. Florence's arthritis had become so bad she struggled to walk without pain. I get out of bed and I feel like an old, old lady 90. <laughs> I toss it around till I get my knees functioning again. Nine months on and Dr Bright couldn't be happier with her results. She's um, got a better than 80% improvement so far, so she's happy. She's not totally out of the woods yet. Still, in its early days, the procedure is experimental and, according to Dr Bright, there are no guarantees. Our success rate is around 75%. One person who didn't benefit from stem cell therapy is Dr Ross Walker. My experience with stem cell therapy wasn't good, but other people have had a very good response from stem cell therapy. He underwent the procedure for arthritis in his knees at a different clinic in 2011. I think that it will become prime time therapy. It will be established therapy maybe in five, ten years. At the moment I would still see it as experimental. It is expensive. It's not covered by Medicare. Five months since being treated and Jeff has returned for his follow up. We were a little bit sceptical whether it would work in the first place because there wasn't an immediate response to it. But yeah, the response is, is definitely there over this period. He claims the improvement has allowed him to get back to doing what he loves most. You are on your feet for most of the day. How does the knee feel now? Right now, the knee feels terrific. How does that compare to what it was like, say, six months ago? You just don't want to stand up. But just, just standing around coaching actually hurts and, um, you know, you just want to go and sit down, really. At this stage, it's still unknown whether Jeff's improvement will be permanent. Our health is everything to us, and particularly those of us who are active. Um, and I, you know, I feel just quietly happy with things that are going along in the, in the right direction. Well, if you think this treatment might be right for you, you should definitely seek the advice of your doctor.